Oh! Oh, shit! <laughs> okay, I'm out of shotgun ice. I'm probably screwed now. Just have to get lucky! Oh! Fuck! Get off your perch, bitch! Oh, shit! Oh! Woo! Finish him. has begun to stop Sigma and let's play Mega Man X Project Zero. Well viewers, we took out Chill Penguin last time. Very, very annoying fight. Now I have to switch to my fucking USB controller just to get through the rest of the game. Hopefully I won't have to use my keyboard again, so I'm going to have to master it on my controller again. It's not going to be fun, but it, it has to be done. Now, next stage, Rajas! Our next Maverick stage will be... Oop, no! Ah, uh, I didn't want to go there. Damn. The hand of fate is a cruel mistress. Crap. Well, looks like we're going to stay in chameleon stage. Maybe? No, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. We are not going to stay in chameleon stage. We'll wait till later. Roll the dice again! I'm leaving that in. <laughs> yeah, we're going to this guy's stage next. The only Maverick boss in the in the series that has a really sexy porn name, Spark Mandrill. Yes, get it, Spark Man Drill. Huh? So his dick is a giant lightning rod, and he's a man driller. Oh. I like where this is going. That being said, though, his stage theme is amazing. I love it. That being said, though, we got the shotgun ice last time from from defeating Chill Penguin. Whoa! Shots are as useless as whoa as ever. Wait for it. Uh oh. Ow. All right. Careful. Careful. Uh oh. Careful. Careful. Ah. Come on. Come on. There you go. Sh shit. Definitely don't want to come here <laughs> at this point in the game, honestly. Now, I if memory serves. Whoa. I think they changed it so because some of the Maverick stages change depending on which ones you go to first. See, whoa! The fuck was that? Huh. Oh, I see. So they're trying to light my way for me while also trying to kill me at the same time. Huh. Oh! How nice of you! In any case, we got the crane neck cock head thingies. Ha! Bitch! Huh. Looks like Spark Mandrill forgot to pay his electric bill. Bit! Uh oh! Move! You! There you go. Brah. I need energy! Uh <laughs> oh! <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Alright. Moving on! There you go. Uh, what the hell? That's weird. Back in. Back in OG X1, I think there'd be a heart tank here. It's it's gone. It's not there no more. Hmm. Why though? I didn't know that they changed the locations of them. Huh. Well, this will be interesting. Or maybe I'm thinking of a, l a later section in the stage. Guess we'll have to see. Whoa! Huh. Shock! Surprise! Anyone? In any case, mini boss time. Uh oh, oh! Yeah, this mini boss was never fun to deal with anyway. But now it's just gotten even harder! Move, 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 move! Uh oh! Fuck! If only Air Dash was a. Uh oh! A thing! Whoa! Slow down effect, much Batman? <laughs> Come on, bitch! Ah, damn it. The move, 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 move! Woo! You see it? Go! Bruh. <laughs> Too slow! Woo! Got him! <laughs> that was mega close. Mega close. I had to end up using my shotgun ice. The nice thing about the shotgun ice viewers is that if you use it against an enemy, well, not use it against an enemy, but if you hit the wall with it, it can ricochet into four 
um, separate little um, ice shot bullet things that can still hit the enemy if it happens to be in range. So it is actually pretty nice. Good thing I save stated this time. But now I'm low on health. This is going to be interesting. And I also need to get energy for the, from my shotgun knife for the boss. This will be even more annoying. Now, what the fuck are these? <laughs> road rage! Nah, nah. But yeah, these literally are road rage bots. These are the definition of people that go through road rage. Yeah. Speed! Tables! Oh! Oh! Ow! Oh! Yeah. Slow down! Do not pass go! Uh, careful. Whoa! Okay, now this is fucking dumb. Careful. A uh, little bit more. This is way too fucking close. It's like I'm playing a classic series game. Holy cow. Alright, I need some energy game. Can you spare a cup of energy? Uh, whoa! Woo!
attempts. That was fucking annoying. But we did it! Yes! Man. Try tackling this stage without the shotgun ice. That's the challenge. In any case, we get the electric spark. Fires electric balls. Because obviously Spark Mandrill's balls were not... Actually, his balls were bigger than mine. Oh, my. Just don't... Su uh, 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 yeah. D uh, forget what I just said. That being said, though, I wonder. Well, let's tackle one more Maverick stage for the day. Run and dice! Our next stage will be... Yes! We're going up to the sky! We are going! Storm Eagle stage! Yes. One odd thing is that they don't say the names of the bosses in this in this um this modded app um version, which is sad, honestly. Oh well. Ugh. One thing I did read is that Zero has higher jumping power in this game compared to um you know compared to X. So this will be interesting to say the least. All right. As a matter of fact, let me save stay before I fuck this up because I know. This one section of the stage is really fucking annoying. Oh yeah, viewers, remember when I tried to do Mega Man X Hard Type and I e e epically failed at it? Yeah, I tried to do another run of it and stuff like that to try and see if I could actually complete the game. Ugh! Yes! Okay, the Heart Tank is still here because it was here in the original. Nice. But yeah, I got to Storm Eagle stage in Mega Man X Hard Type, right? Apparently, every time I tried to get up here, there was always multiple of these fucking helicopter things. Then on top of that, the gaps were longer. Enemies hit harder. That's why it's a hard type game. So, like, if you don't have the necessary amount of balls, you're not going to fucking win anything. That's just how the game is. You need a big set of balls. Don't have to be hairy. They just have to be balls. Oh! Not electric balls, though. Speaking of which, all right, all right, hello! <laughs> all right, I don't want to waste too much of my weapon energy. Whoa! Huh? That's not fair. How come the boss gets a flamethrower? Hey! The sub tank is still here. Nice. Yeah, the sub tank. Wow, they kept the sub tank in the same spot as the original. Okay, so that's the thing. Why isn't... Whoa! Shit. <laughs> so why is it that the, um... What? Oh, about to say. Why is it that the sub tank in Spark Mandrill stage was not there? I wonder. That's weird. It should have stayed in the same place. I mean, if the sub tank here was in the same place as the original, why wasn't the one in Spark Mandrill stage in the same spot? What was the point of changing the location? Hmm. Well, they probably have an idea. Alright, I just have to get myself back up here. Come on, Zero. Yes! Oh, what? Oh. <sighs> yeah. We're in an aerial stage, and yet we got flamethrowers. How does that work, game? Alright, well, we got the hard tank and the sub tank. All that's left to do now. Oh, yeah, that's right! There is another, um... Well, back in the OG, it would be an, um... An upgrade for X, but there is an upgrade for Zero here. Ah! Our viewers are Mac. Okay, <laughs> that fall was lame. But now I made it all the way across to the gap. Well, before I died, that is, to the, in that last part. Now there is something over here. We need to destroy these um gas canister things. But yeah, just use the Buster or something else. Charge it up. Ah! Yes! There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Extra life. There was another one of these canister thingies that was near the entry or near the beginning of the stage that you could get an extra life cap or energy capsule there. So there you go. Now the upgrade for X would normally be around here. There it is. All right. Yeah, no, I wasn't going crazy. Unless they move this too. Let's find out. <laughs> there you go. Yup, there it is! Hey, Dr. Wily's ghost! <laughs> Dr. Wily's ghost. That's a new one. Yeah, <laughs> I knew you would find it, Zero. Enter. 
to receive the ultimate helmet. Go ahead, try try it on those blocks. Right. I can't believe I'm thanking Dr. Wily, but thank you, Dr. Wily's ghost. <laughs> well, let's get the helmet upgrade. Yes! With that, we can destroy these blocks. That's pretty much it. It doesn't serve any other purpose. One thing that's annoying is that I wish they... Like, if they were going to give Zero the upgrades that X would probably normally get in a, in a, in a regular playthrough, why is it that they're giving him the same shit that, um, that X got? Like, spice it up a little bit. Give us something a bit more. You know what I mean? It just seems dumb to give Zero the same upgrades that you're that you would that X would normally get. Like spice it up a little bit. I mean I know there's well if anything, I know there's a body and an and an X Buster upgrade with this too. If we're if we're gonna be playing the same as with regards to how X would get his upgrades normally. So I just wish they did a little bit more with regards to Zero, but considering this is X1, Zero does not get his saber until, well, X2. And even then, he don't get it till like near the end of the game. So, you know, there you go. Oh, yeah. oh slow! Save state. Let's try this again, shall we? Yeah. Woo! Look how simple that was! Whoa, shit! Oh! Oh, shit! You're not packing that missile in me! Sorry! <laughs> Alright. We don't have the boss's weapon weakness, so this will be interesting. Alright, let's do it! I didn't even do anything. Hey, dude. So how's it going? I'm gonna knock you off my plane. Get off my plane! It's time for a boss fight versus Storm Eagle. Now, I don't have his weapon weakness, so we're just gonna have to play this by ear. Luckily, unlike this fight with Spark Mandrill, I have a sub tank, even if there's not enough energy in it. At least we're getting somewhere. It's better than nothing. Oh, oh! Well, fuck you. Yeah, watch out for that attack there, the Storm Tornado. He will literally try and knock you off of the plane. And if he does, well, you're screwed. Yeah, because how are you going to get back up? You won't be able to. Ah! You just keep firing the shotgun ice. It's not his weapon weakness, but it'll fucking do. Alright. Come on, fucker. Ah! Your chickadees don't scare me. <laughs> All right, gonna have to rely on the buster now. The pressure is on. Oh. oh, careful. Oh, what? Gotta predict where he's gonna fly down from. And Storm out or Storm Eagle's attacks hit really hard if he dies down on you. So you gotta try to avoid the attack as best as you can. Are you gonna fight me like a man, bird thing? Cause it's getting ridiculous. Ah! Do you honestly think shit like that is going to make a difference? Not really. Come on. Time for me to clip those wings. Now! Ah! Got him! Woohoo! Wings clipped. Can I have my Zephyr badge now? Uh, no, no, no. Shout out to the, shout out to the viewers who gets the reference. Now, that was tedious as fuck. But for winning, we get the Storm Tornado, one of the best weapons in the game. Yes, it definitely is the best weapon, the best boss weapon in the game. In all, in, in, in my honest opinion. 
But with that, our favorite porn star, Maverick Boss, gave us a hard time, but we managed to pull through. And taking it to the air, we clipped some wings. Three down, five more to go. But what awaits us in our next battle? Find out next time. You guys enjoy it, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for gaming bits from me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment. Duh. Till next time, dudes and dudettes. This is Michael Rage for Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smell you later.